What's up YouTube, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we're gonna be looking at Synapse. Now, she is currently in the item shop. She is an epic outfit. She does come with two selectable styles and she does come with a back lane, the hollow pack. So without further ado guys, let's get this review started. So Synapse. It's actually been quite a while since the skin itself actually returned and I do think it's because of the fractions in the zero point or at least in storyline. Now the skin itself is very decent. She was released during season nine of chapter one and the skin is very good. She does have two selectable styles which actually helps the skin out. The only downfall again is the backlink. The backlink itself is just like a futuristic backpack with a hologram on it and they just called it a day. I would have wished the backlink itself would have had two selectable styles similar to that of the outfit and it's something that Fortnite could easily do just by changing the color palette of the backlink. So how does it hold up in 2021? Now the skin itself is very decent still. It does have selectable styles and for it not being back in quite some time, it actually helped the skin out. So what's my final rating for Synapse? I'm gonna have to give Synapse a seven out of 10. The skin itself is decent, but uh, there's other skins that are epic that are way worth it. It didn't help either that she did come to the item shop back when all the icon series outfits did come out since all of them are exactly the same price tag and you do have a skin like ninja that has four selectable styles and a very cool backlink so this one actually just gets drowned with all the skins that were released today then you also have the backlink which is mediocre and to be completely honest i would just skip the skin right now and get another item shop outfit that is out at the moment so without further ado guys let's get these combos started now for our first combination with the outfit, we are going to be looking at the default edit style and we're going to be pairing it up with the up north. It's funny how the up north recently just came out and it just combines with a lot of skins perfectly. The color scheme of the backpack and then even the zippers and bottle holders all do have different color schemes that goes very good with the outfit. Then for the harvesting tool, we're going to be going with the star strike. The star strike harvesting tool does have a similar color palette to that of the outfit and overall fits perfectly with the theme as well. Then for the contra, we're going to be going with the bright box. Now the bright box contra you could obtain it right now if you did purchase the battle pass and it's just very colorful and matches really good with the color palette then for the glider we're gonna be going the side rider the side rider glider just have a very cool aura on it and even though it doesn't match perfectly it still has some color palettes that match perfectly with the outfit and for the wrap we're gonna be going with the prismatic edge the prismatic edge does have a very cool animation on the wrap itself that is very colorful and goes very good with the backing and outfit then for the Synapse. We are going to be pairing her up this time with the Starfield. Now the Starfield backlink fits perfectly with her default edit style. The curse skins are almost identical and again the theme is there. Now the Forsaken Strike is a one-handed harvesting tool that looks very cool and has a cool animation when you swing it. Then for the control, we're going to be going with the Hyper Flight. The Hyper Flight control you could obtain it right now in the Battle Pass and it just matches perfectly because of combinations of colors. Then for the glider, we're going to be going with the Convergence. The Convergence glider does have the butterflies of the Rift itself on them, so it matches really well. Then for the wrap, we're going to be going with the chipset. Now the chipset wrap does have a very cool animation on it. It does have a chip on it that looks very cool and matches perfectly with the outfit. And for our last combination with Synapse with default edit style that we are going to be pairing her up with the Star Crest Shift. Now for the Star Crest Shift, I am using the Galaxy Blue edit style, which is a backlink that you did obtain for free if you did your challenges. The color schemes of the backlink itself in the futuristic look goes very good with the outfit. Then for the harvesting tool, we're going to be going with the Astrolax. Now the Astrolax itself is a harvesting tool you do purchase in the item shop for 1200 V-Bucks. The color schemes is almost identical and it fits very good with the theme. Then for the control, we're gonna be going with the Soros. The Soros control does have a flame that is blue and purple that goes very good with the back thing and outfit. Then for the glider, we're gonna be going with the Comet Crasher. The Comet Crasher itself does have a basically just a comet as you ride into the battlefield, but it does have a similar aura to that of the control itself. Then for the wrap, we're gonna be going with the Soros. The Soros wrap matches really well because of the color scheme of the whole combination. It does have purple and blue, which goes very good with the outfit. Now for the honorable mention with Synapse with the default edit style, you could pair it up with anything with purple. Anything with white or like a bluish color scheme is gonna go very good because her color scheme of her hair is blue.
Now for our next combination with Synapse with the green edit style that we are going to be pairing her up with the Bag of Shadows. What I really like about this backlink, it does have a little bit of minimalistic green, which goes very well with the outfit since she does have primary green. Then for the harvesting tool, we're going to be going with the Medax. Now for the Medax, we are going to be using the Toxin Edit Style, which actually gives the harvesting tool itself into a black and green color scheme that is similar to that of the backlink and outfit. Then for the Contra, we're going to be going with the Retro Sci-Fi. Since the outfit itself does have a lot of green, the Retro Sci-Fi was the perfect match for a Contra. Then for the Glider, we're going to be going with the Green Eagle. The Green Eagle Glider does have a similar green to that of the outfit and it matches really well when you're descending to the battlefield. Then for the wrap, we're going to be going with the Bubbly. The Bubbly wrap does have an animation of bubbles going across it, but the main reason why I'm using it is for the green color scheme. Then for our next combination with Synapse, we're going to be pairing her up with the Illusion Rune. Now this whole combination was actually based off the wrap itself and the Illusion Room just actually matches perfectly. Then for the harvesting tool, we're going to be going with the Fright Clubs. Now the Fright Clubs themselves does have a similar color scheme to that of the backlink and outfit and it just merges both of them together perfectly. And for the Contra, we're going to be going with the Sith Streak. The Sith Streak is a Contra you do obtain in the item shop for 500 V-Bucks and it matches really good because of the green aesthetics. Then for the Glider, we're going to be going the Pixel Pivot with the default letter salt. Now the Pixel Pivot itself does have a Galactica feel to it, but the main reason why I'm using it is for the green color scheme. And for the wrap, we're going to be going with the Witchy. Now this is the main reason why I actually made this combo. The Witchy wrap just matches really good with the purplish and green color scheme it does have. And for our last combination with Synapse with the green edit style, we are going to be pairing her up with the Rogue Spider Shield. Now the Rogue Spider Shield with the black and green edit style matches really good because of the green aesthetics they both share. Then for the harvesting tool, we're going to be going with the Cosmic Cleavers with the default edit style. Now the Cosmic Cleavers themselves does have a green and black color scheme that goes very good with the outfit. Then for the Contra, we're going to be going with the Berylin Flames. Now the flames themselves are green, so it's a perfect fit for a Contra. Then for the Glider, we're going to be going with the Wasp. The Wasp Glider does have a black and green color scheme that is similar to that of the outfit she is wearing. And for the Wrap, we're going to be going with the Cold Green. The Cold Green Wrap does have this green animation on it that looks very clean and matches perfectly because of the green aesthetics. Now for the honorable mentions with Synapse with the green edit style, you could pair it up with anything that does have green. Also, anything with white or black is going to look very good since they are blank canvases and they're just going to pop whenever you use them with her. Now for our next combination, we are going to be focusing on the Hollow Pack and we are going to be pairing it up with the Luminos. Now the Luminos outfit does have a similar color palette to that of the backlink and they both match perfectly together. Then for the harvesting tool, we are going to be going with the Sparkle Scythe. Now the Sparkle Scythe itself does have green, pink and even black which complements the outfit and backlink. Then for the Contra, we are going to be going with the Photon. The Photon Contra does have this aura surrounding the character that is either blue or pink which complements the outfit. Then keeping this whole combination interstellar, we're going to be going with the Star Cross for the glider. The glider itself does have these meteors that are basically just in each hand and then it does produce an aura that is similar to that of the control. And for the wrap, we're going to be going with the Shark Break. The Shark Break wrap does have a purple color scheme that goes very good with the outfit and overall fits perfectly with the theme as well. For our next combination with the Hollow Pack, we are going to be pairing it up with the rocks. Now for rocks, we are going to be looking at the stage 5 with the purple color scheme and then for the secondary, we are going to be using blue. I just think the whole futuristic look of rocks fits perfectly with the background. Then for the harvesting tool, we are going to be going with the high octane. It was actually shocking that this harvesting tool actually did have similar color palettes to that of rocks and the backlink. Then for the control, we are going to be going with the Soros. The Soros control does produce this flame that is similar to that of the outfit's color scheme. Then for the glider, we are going to be going with the holographic glider. The holographic glider is almost identical to that of the blue that the skin does have and it just looks very futuristic and you could unlock it in the same season that you did obtain rocks. And for the wrap, we are going to be going with the Enigma. The Enigma wrap does have a pinkish and blue color scheme that is identical to that of the skin itself. And even though the skin doesn't really have pink, it still matches perfectly. Then for our next combination with the Hollow Pack, we are going to be pairing it up with the Infinity. Now the Infinity is another futuristic and cosmic character you do have in the game that you do obtain in the item shop for 1500 V-Bucks. The color schemes of the code itself is almost identical to that of the Hollow Pack. Then for the harvesting tool, we are going to be going with the Fire Line. 
The firing line itself is a very cool harvesting tool that does cost you 800 V-Bucks in the item shop. The purple color scheme with blue just fits perfectly with this combination. Then for the control, we're going to be going the lightning strike. Now what I really like about the lightning strike, it invokes the whole character in an aura that does have strikes of lightning hitting it and it is purplish so it matches perfectly. Then for the glider, we're going to be going the celestial. The celestial glider does have a celestial look to it that complements the outfit. And for the wrap, we're going to be going the black violet. The black violet wrap does have purplish and blue color scheme as an animation on the weapon wrap that supports and makes the combination a lot better. And for our last combination with the hollow pack, we are going to be pairing it up with Dream. Now the, now the Dream was a no brainer. I was actually looking for skins that actually match the blue and purple color scheme and Dream has those cosmetic looks. Then for the harvesting tool, we're going to be going with the Stellar Axe. Now for the harvesting tool, if you don't own the Stellar Axe and if you don't own the Galaxy outfit, you could go with the Stargers Strikers which is similar. Now the reason why I like the Stellar Axe is because it's a one wheeling harvesting tool and I just love those harvesting tools more. The combinations of colors of the Stellar Axe combined with Dream match perfectly. Then for the control, we're going to be going with the Hyper Flight. The Hyper Flight control you do attain it during this season and it's a perfect match for Dream. Then for the glider, we're going to be going with the X. Now the X glider you did obtain if you did get a victory royale during season X and it just matches really good because of the control it does leave behind that is blue and pink. Then for the wrap, we're going to be going with the Nebulic. The, now the Nebulic wrap does have a very cosmic look to it. It does have a similar color palette to that of Dream and they just match perfectly together. Now for the honorable mentions with the hollow pack, you could pair it up with anything that does have purple. Anything that does have a bluish color scheme or like a pinkish color scheme as well, it's going to look very good with this backlink. Now those were the 6 combinations I did find for Synapse and the 4 combinations I did find for the Hollow Pack. Let me know in the comments below which one's your favorite. And if you're new to my channel, subscribe, I post a video to your fake cosmetic skins every single day. And if you want to support the channel, my code is ENIGMAKID, all caps, 2Ds, all together. Each time you guys use my code in the item shop or the Epic Game Store, I do get a small percentage of it and I really help this channel grow. And if you guys have any combo suggestions, leave them in the comments below. And for all my social media and Discord, they'll be in the description. And with that being said, guys, I'll catch you guys in the next video. See ya.